안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami. Today we are going to color my hair because it's been a hot minute since I had done my hair red, which turned hot pink, which turned rose gold, which then I put rose gold on top of, which then washed out into a light pink, which then I removed the pink from the red pigments from before. I've never actually had a full on like pastel or purple type of shade in my hair before. So we're gonna do that today with Overtones Pastel Purple Deep Treatment, but I'm also going to use Pastel Pink and Pastel Blue and Pastel Teal to create kind of like a lilac unicorn hair. I've never done unicorn or rainbow hair before. I've only done kind of solid colors. And then that one time I did like a phoenix hair with blonde, yellow, down to an orange and red. Other than that, I've never really had multiple colors in my hair, so I think this will be fun. I'm kind of nervous because I don't know how it'll turn out on my slightly ash hair. Normally when I color my hair with these pigmented conditioners, I usually have platinum hair or blonde hair, so it shows up more. So hopefully it doesn't look too different from what I expect it to, but I'm a little nervous because I don't know what even I'm expecting. So I'm gonna go ahead and shampoo my hair so that the conditioners have direct contact with my hair and no products or no oils are preventing the color from coating my hair. I'm using the Marc Anthony Strengthening Grow Long Sulfate Free Shampoo and the Fanola No Yellow Purple Shampoo as well. Pretty! I'm just gonna towel dry to make sure that my hair is not dripping. Roughly split my hair down the middle. I want a little streak of pink right here. So I'm gonna do that first. Oh my gosh, <laughs> it's happening guys. Oh, I don't know, I hope it shows even. Like, cause my hair is pretty gray and darkish. Hopefully it works. I'm gonna really try to get it in there. <gasps> but I'm excited, oh my gosh. I'm gonna have unicorn hair for the first time. <laughs> Purple. Oh, I'm nervous. Mm. I'm actually gonna really saturate it because I didn't condition my hair after shampooing because this is a conditioner, so. Next section, I wanna put teal. Wow. Oh, it's pretty. I'm gonna go blue. Here I'll do pink and then blue. And then right beside that one. Actually, instead of blue, I feel like the blue comes out more silvery and the teal comes out more blue on my current hair. So let's go teal. Ah. I'm gonna put a little bit of blue in here. I wanna make two sections of pink here, so I'm gonna leave out this, and I'm gonna leave out this section, and do these purple first. I'm gonna wait 15 minutes. We'll wash it out and see how mermaidy I turn out. I feel really slimy right now. Hi, Dad. All right. <laughs> He's brushing his teeth. Let's see what it looks like. Ta da! <gasps> Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I see you. I see you. Uh huh. I feel like because my hair was like ashy before, it did come out a little bit darker than like a pastel-y type unicorn hair. But I know that when hair dries, it does look a little lighter. Like when hair is wet or when anything's wet, like it looks darker. Like, you know, when you get pit stains, when you sweat, your shirt turns dark. So I know that when it dries, it'll look lighter. I like how the colors are segregated. Ooh, it's gonna be pretty. I'm putting in my BioSilk Silk Therapy Leave-In Treatment. 
My hair is so soft right now because every time I use overtone, it makes my hair so, so, so incredibly soft. But I always like to put on a leave-in treatment to make sure my hair is getting extra nutrients since it is over-processed and damaged hair. You want to make sure that you're getting as much care and maintenance as possible. And then I'm going to comb. Ooh. <laughs> I'll be back to show you what my hair looks like when it's all dry. By the way, my mug came in. <laughs> my Nacho Fam merch mug came in. I'm so excited because I also ordered like new designs that we just launched. When they come in, I'll show you what it looks like. It's so cute. But yeah, I just got my silicone reusable straw. Make sure to stay hydrated and don't gulp your water because it'll weaken your esophagus. I'm back. Look, it's like a kind of dusty purple with streaks of pink and blue kind of incorporated let's take these braids out and see what our hair looks like yeah it looks dustier than it does pastel but it's very pretty oh definitely unicorn feel wow what do you think i feel like it's a nice kind of base purple with streaks of rainbow kind of unicorn colors i'm just gonna quickly do a little pass through on the ends here just so my ends don't look whack hello mr hardworking consultant hi what's going on what do you think uh well it looks nice do i look like a mermaid mermaid mm, unicorn it's i feel like it's a little dark and dusty to be unicorn. Yeah, it's not definitely not pastel. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah, it works. It's cool. If you like this video and would like to see more, definitely make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification to be notified right when new videos come out. That's usually the time that we do take to reply to your comments. I also post every day on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat. So I'll check you out on these platforms if they are platforms that you use. Let me know what you think. I think it came out really pretty, like multi-shaded kind of dusty lavender it's almost like a lavender more than a lilac and we'll see you next time bye